Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's question is All amino acids are considered amphoteric. If a substance is said to be amphoteric, what is true about this substance? And here is the variance of the answers. Take a look at this picture. Amino acids are amphoteric compounds as they contain both acidic and basic groups. Depending on the pH of the solution, they can behave as both acids and bases. In low pH solution, carboxyl group is going to get hydrogen and on the overall net charge is going to be positive. In high pH, carboxyl group is going to lose hydrogen and amino group is also going to lose hydrogen and on the overall molecule is going to be negatively charged. And at the certain pH level, this amino acid can have both positive charge and negative charge and we call this molecule Zwitteran. And if we run a gel, the same amino acid, depending on the pH of the media, would run to the negative pole if it is going to be low pH or is going to go to positive pole if it's going to be high pH solution. And the pH at which the amino acid has no tendency to move either towards positive nor negative electrode is called isoelectric pH or isoelectric point. At isoelectric pH, the amino acid molecule bears net charge of zero. And if we run a gel, such molecule is not going to move to any electrode, no matter if it is positively or negatively charged. And now we can choose an answer. We call amphoteric such a substance which can act as an acid and base. And this is answer B. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. See you in the next video. Goodbye.